Hey, what's up guys? I just wanna make a real quick video about hand wash car part four. Um, so yeah, washing your car, man, it's rough. It's crazy, you gotta have two buckets, all right? Then you put the, the grate for the bucket. <laughs> all right, man, I'm done with this car wash story, man. <laughs> Just get, just get whatever you can, man. Just get whatever you can. <laughs> I hope for the best, man. Just life is rough. As soon as you get done washing it, you're going to hit a tree or, or something. Somebody's going to steal the car. Who cares, man? Just do whatever your dad did, man. Just, do whatever you, just take whatever you got lying around, man. Take some, some dish soap, man. They, they use the... Get the dawn, man. They use it on ducks. It'll be fine, man. Just get, Put the dish soap on there and just forget about it, man. It's, it's a lot more things to worry about, man. Just matter of fact, man, you got that new car, man. Just, just return it at the end of 60 days. They probably give you a refund, no question asked or whatever. And uh, just keep doing that and just don't even wash the car, man. It's not worth it, man. It's not worth. Matter of fact, though, then again, I, I really don't even have anything else to talk about. So let's go ahead, man. Let's talk. I'm going to tell you how to wash the car, man. So, so yeah, I had a wheel brush. <laughs> I had a microfiber cloth. I had a, <laughs> two buckets. <laughs> yeah, so take the, the two buckets. You fill one bucket with clean water, and the other bucket, you fill it with the, the water that you're going to use for the shampoo, right? So that way, once you put the the sponge in the water, but of course you can't get a sponge, you gotta get a glove with like all kind of crazy microfiber stuff coming off of it. So you gotta get a glove or some kind of car wash mitt, right? And then you gotta dip that in the soapy water, right? And then you're gonna wash the car, right? But don't put the don't put the glove back in the soapy water because then all the dirt you just took off the car, you're gonna mix it back into your soapy water, right? So put it back into the, the uh, <laughs> <laughs> the clean water that's the rinse water man so go ahead and rinse it off in there rub it against the grate put it back in the soapy water rub it against the grate again then wash your car make sure you wash from top to bottom otherwise you're gonna have water you're gonna have soap stains coming down the car the whole time when you're washing the bottom to the top all the soapy shit all the soapy dirty stuff is gonna come back down so make sure you wash from top to bottom do it in sections get it done fast don't let the sun be out drying up the soap and make it all weird Make sure you're in the shade or it's cloudy or it's the end of the day or the beginning of the day or it's not too hot. Um, yeah, because then you're gonna, all the soap's gonna dry on the car, man. <laughs> you're gonna be sad. You're gonna be sad, man, so don't do it. Uh, rinse the car off often, you know, and then uh, at the end, make sure you dry it off with a microfiber cloth, man. You got to dry all the water, else you're going to have water spots. And and for the for the windows, man, get a glass cleaner, man. Don't do what I did and use the shampoo on the windows. It's cool at first, and then you try to drive off into the sunset with your girl, and she's going to be like, what's up with these uh, swirls on the window shield, man? And you're going to be like, man, I suck. And the whole thing be for nothing, man. So, you know. Don't just use the uh, glass cleaner, man. And don't forget your door jams. Uh, and uh, never use your sponge on the wheels, all right? Or the tires, obviously. I hope that's obvious. Anyway, <laughs> uh, good luck, man. I hope, I hope the car wash comes out nice. So at least something went right for you.